Do you want to place transitions between two video clips like Let's this? Let's head over to my iPad and I'll show you how to do it using the InShot video editor. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here and you're looking for technology tips, tricks, and tutorials, you've come to the right place. If you find this video helpful, subscribe. This is the fourth video in my InShot video editor app tutorial series. I hope you've enjoyed it so far. If you'd like to watch the other videos to get caught up, keep an eye out for the YouTube card on screen later in the video. You can also check out the recommended playlist in the description below. Transitions are the effects that you can place between two video clips to make videos more interesting. Let's open the InShot app. Tap the video icon, then tap New. Here's the video selection window. Select the first video clip. You need at least two clips to use a transition. Select the second by tapping the plus sign. Choose a second clip. Let's take a look at what it looks like with no transition. And I'll show you how to do it using the InShot video editor. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. Tap the white circle to add a transition. I've removed the audio from this section. Watch the screen as I scroll through the different transition options. Scroll through the options by tapping on each one. Choose the one that looks best to you. You can increase or decrease the length of the transition using the slider underneath the video. There are two rows of transitions available, the basic and the super transitions. The super transitions, the second row, are only available if you pay for the pro version of this app. I have the basic version, so the super transitions are not available to me. Tap the check mark. Once you decide what transition you want to use, tap the play button to see the transition. And I'll show you how to do it using the InShot video editor. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. I'll show you how to do it using the InShot video editor. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. To save the completed video, tap the share icon and then tap save. Processing will begin. As usual, don't lock the screen. Let the screen turn off or switch between apps while this is happening. If you do, the video may not save properly. Once processing is complete, the video will be saved in your video library, and then you can add it to any project you like. In the next video, I'll discuss how to change the canvas. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. If you have a problem with any part of this process, leave a comment below so I can help you. Don't forget to click that thumbs up if you liked the video. Please feel free to check out some of my other videos suggested on screen. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.